Hello everyone, this is Kyle from We Tech Care of You, and today I'm just going to create a quick video on how to just do countdown timer in Power Apps. So this is actually pretty out of the box and, and basic. Um, it's to do, just do a countdown timer. It's called a timer control. Um, and one of the reasons for doing this is I just need this for another project. I couldn't actually find much documentation on to make a countdown. Um, so I thought I'd just do a quick video on just setting one of them up, very basic. Uh, we just create a new app. Just tab the layout. And then what you want to do is on your screen, if you just do insert, And if you go to input and then down to timer, this will add a timer control to your app. So I'll just make this full screen and I'll just change the font size to 30 to 150. Okay, so there's the, the, the control added. Um, we've got the timer set on that as well, the duration. Is 60 seconds so if now we run run this and just click on the timer control this will start the clock ticking now one of the things that i actually wanted was the clock to tick backwards because i wanted it to be a countdown timer so the way you can change that is if you go to the text properly on the control and you've got this command here so what we need to do is if you just change this command um and you just need to make a slight change so it's showing the following so it's the time of duration minus the time of value and as you can see now it started at a one and um, so now this will just count backwards so if i just press play on this click the control that will just start counting down from a minute backwards so there you have it very basic very quick to do um and there's a timer control hope this video helps someone um and take care thank you